Hey everybody, this is Andy. Um, I'm actually working on Char system at the office. We got a hum that's happening, but really we can't get rid of it all the way. I'm gonna go directly into it. We've had something, uh, something big has happened, right, Char? Are you there, Char? Yes, absolutely. Yeah, I'm here. Okay, if you guys notice on 5-10-2012, on five ten twenty twelve, we uploaded the video of Leonard Martinez, which is kind of the final kick in the face to Daryl and Ryan because they did say that D Leonard wasn't our ex-tag attorney. We didn't have a bump lawsuit. We didn't have, you guys, we uploaded this and let me be happy to tell you that Chris now, Chris Engelbrecht follows. This is one of my first partners that got manipulated by this man. But not only does he follow me, he's connected to me at LinkedIn, he's actually following Char. Char, where is he following you? Uh, I'm pretty sure the kids follow me on Twitter, was he, it? He probably is. He's, follow, sure he's following Twitter. Steve Kleemark. He's following Steve Kleemark on his LinkedIn. He's following me. He's following... I think he's finally opened his eyes, but I believe... I believe since Char took a picture and yeah, caught something last it. night... Here, let's, let's just let it out, Char. Here you guys go in the first minute. Let me pull it up real quick so you guys can see it. Minimize right here. If you notice that people have been blogging, of course, at Daryl's slander site. But I want you guys all to see, Cypher 77 May 6 is Chris. And Chris is sitting there saying the same stuff because he's so manipulated by Daryl. Well, go ahead. I don't want to take too long on this. So the next one is a person named R-E-L-I-A. And as you can see, they're very happy for all the highlighted videos. And the next one after that, you guys pause it. The next one after that, you'll see that Dar Brian Butcher writes, It's so funny, Andy still thinks he's going to win. You guys, Ryan Butcher partnered up with Logan Laws. Logan Laws will be at trial. He, he partnered up with the kid, Logan Laws, like he said at the preliminary hearing. But this is the one that we're really happy about because it's finally happened. At, we posted Leonard's video on the 10th. Rita, R-E-L-I-A, came back May 14th. Um, 2012 at 1.11 a.m. Char took a picture of this last night. This morning at 7 a.m. or 6 a.m. It was gone, right, Char? Daryl deleted yeah, it. Yeah, absolutely. Okay, Daryl not only deleted it, but as Mr. Rila or Rayla, whatever this is, says right here, Daryl has removed all his blogs from this site. What's going on, D? But this is what I've been waiting for because I've been protecting this man. To I've been protecting John Richards since the beginning. I videotaped our meeting February 8th. And so I figured John Richards had nothing but this person blogs last night and Daryl deleted it already, everybody, as usual. He writes, Daryl Ackerman told us that John Richards was running the show and Leonard Martinez was not Andy's ex-tag attorney. I just watched 5-10-2012 video of Leonard Martinez. Per have you all noticed that Daryl has removed all his blogs from the site? You guys, they're, they're not kidding. Let me show you this big. This and is actually the picture. And to ask all confused, like to a friend, what's up, D? Exactly. That's what D does all the time. That's what Daryl does all the time. But my main thing here is I've been protecting John Richards since the beginning. This is the picture that Char took on his cam before Daryl deleted it. But if we go to my ma my main page, you'll also see that John Richards is still, to this day, has Daryl as a friend. Now, what you guys don't know is that we actually have been following Daryl since 2009. So there's a lot for you to learn, but this is big. Because we've always yeah. wondered how Daryl is getting away with everything. John Richards is worth well, $700 million, okay, guys, from American Fork. I had a meeting with them February 8th. I recorded the whole meeting, me, Kyle, and Lad. But this, is, it answers so much. It answers yeah, why Daryl can sit there and blog about prosecutors saying that they were laughing back and forth to each other. It answers why KC, the prosecutor in Bountiful, started manipulating everything. And then we find out later that Mr. Holge is involved with him. This answers Great so answer much of what's been going on that I'm just flabbergasted by it all. But the thing is, is honestly, I'm just happy that we're finally hitting... We're finally reaching the guys that have been manipulated. You guys, I didn't want these guys to go to jail. Chris and Kyle, I knew they've been getting manipulated since the beginning. Will they listen to us, Char? Will they ever listen no. to us? No. No, they don't. And, so, we, and we try. So you know what? Now that Daryl's posted this, whoever no, Rilla is, and, and he's right, Char. 
He he erased everything, Shar. He erased yeah, no, everything that has his already. name at the website. You guys, I want to cut this short. I don't want it too long. Already we're up to um, 312 seconds. I want to show you something real quick before I hang, I hang up on you because i got to talk to Shar. If you guys go in here, you'll actually see that I have videos that date back as far as, hold on, properties. This one was done December 27th of 2009. Okay, and you'll actually see the manipulation in these videos are huge, are huge, huge. You'll see that right yeah. here on Tuesday, May of 2009, May 22, Tuesday, the 26th of May of 2009, Ryan was blogging under assumed names, Girl X, the, a guy named Jay, Jay Rin, uh, what was the name? Sorry, I can't remember. Um, Jaren. Um, Jaren, Jaren, J-A-R-I-N says, this site is a scam. The owner took me for a lot of money, too. Well, where is he, Shar, in trial? Where right. is, is J-A-R-I-N? And look at the dates, guy, uh, guys. Tuesday, the 26th, May 2009. Okay? How, what did we do? You, you go to Ryan's website. Right here. Look, guys. I got everything in video, guys. You'll actually see a video start of Ryan talking about on May 26, 2009, that X-Tag is so stupid of a concept, so ridiculous, and you guys know Bump now, right, guys? You all know Bump, but you'll actually see these guys talking smack in these videos that are old from 2009, and they're all dated the same day. So now what are you going to say, Daryl? Daryl, this is to you since the no-contact order got sent to you. Get ready. It stopped. It killed us right there. Hold on, hold on. I gotta, I gotta, I gotta stop everything. Give me a second. Hold on. Let me close this. Okay, everybody, we have to stop because we set it. Me and Shar set this to go off at a certain time. Shar, are you there? You'll yeah, see all the evidence at trial, guys. Shar, you want to say anything before I hang up? Uh, you know, just condolences to you and your family for the loss. You know, while we're going through this, kind of negated you being able to hang with some family that's out there in Bountiful at the same time and uh, now you uh, I, I never family members, hey Shar so I, I appreciate I appreciate that from the bottom of my heart but I actually didn't say nothing about my uncle dying in, in Ogden and I haven't been able to go because of all this bull but you know what he's in a better place he's in heaven already Absolutely. and that's what the world is a filtration system for people like yeah. Daryl and Ryan that's all I got to say yeah. Let's get back to saving the world, bro. God bless you. See, God bless you all, and see you all at trial.